all of our fermentation is with honey instead of grapes, which makes us a meadery. So the firm is kind of a play on words. So we are in historic downtown Conroe on Symington across the street from the courthouse. We are surrounded by lawyers. lawyers. We were thinking about, well, what are we gonna call this place? And my wife is a critical thinker between the two of us. So she goes, how about the firm? And she goes, no, no, we do fermentation and we're right in the middle of a bunch of law firms. Okay. And I thought, okay, that, that could work. And it's actually worked quite well. So she's the brains behind everything. Absolutely. <laughs> we have our menu. Of course, you can look through this. But we do two types of fermentation here. We do a full strength, 115 to 12% still mead, which is your standard wine style. We also do a 55 to 6.5% carbonated, okay. which some people call it beer style, but it's all fermented with honey. All right, so how does this work? We have what's called a pick five. Okay. So here's it's what we've got. Lottery. We've got these great little boards that uh, a friend of mine made us. Very They've nice. got chalk marker here, mm -hmm. so where you can write the corresponding number on the menu, okay. and then we will fill that up and do tastings. I'm gonna go ahead and go with three, four, and five. Oh wow, you're going all for the uh, for the carbonated. I'm gonna go with 22. 22, you've jumped right to my favorite. What should I make my last one? Do you like apple pie? Uh, who doesn't like apple pie? Apple, apple pies are. It's oh, like apple. apple pie in a glass. I will show you what I'm drinking. This is our alchemy. Okay, I put that on my... You on did, my yes, number 22 on the menu. Okay. And this isn't a super sweet mead, but it's not a super dry mead either. It's kind of right there in the middle. But what makes this special is we actually caramelize the honey prior to going through fermentation. So after the fermentation, we then went to our friends over at Copperhead Brewery and got some of their King of Terrors or KOT barrels. It's a 17% coffee, chocolate, vanilla stout aged in a Booker's whiskey barrel. Oh, so what you've a got, flavor profile. Can't go wrong with all of those. Pine Hopple is our absolute best seller. Well, it's got pineapple in it, right? It smells pineapple. And it's got a citra hop. Ooh, yeah. Oh yes, that is delicious. We cannot keep pine hopple on tap. I can see why. The jalapeno, yes. which is rimmed in orange blossom honey with tahini, a little splash of lime. Ooh. You got a little spice there. A little spicy. It smells like apple yeah. pie filling. This is giving me all the feels yeah. of fall. It's the spices today. that you taste in there, your, your oh. cinnamon, your nutmeg. I can't tell you how much fun this has been. Yeah. I've learned, I've had great mead, great conversation. Thank you so much for uh, spending your time here with us at Firm Meadery.